Hey yo, so do you remember those skinny kids in school that used to think they were tough because no one ever picked a fight with them? Even the bullies took pity on them because they were so skinny and scrawny they thought they might snap them like a twig. You know the kind I mean. I'm a yellow belt in karate man. Which is kind of like what a script kid he is. He doesn't know how to program but he wants to hack. Um, he's just watched The Matrix one too many times and believes that he is the one to return order to the universe. Or is that Star Wars? Except now the difference is that that little skinny kid has grown up. He's probably filled out a bit. Maybe he's gone to the gym and worked on those guns. And the worst thing is getting tooled up for him isn't that difficult. He can come up you with things that are far more sharper, bigger and badder. Which really asks the question, are you still capable of defending yourself against this skinny, scrawny kid who you should have really snapped when he was a twig? Now, Josh Corman made a similar observation and he called it H.D. Moore's Law. Uh, for those of you who don't know, H.D. Moore is a guy who developed Metasploit. It's like a point and click hacking tool. Effectively, making him the guy that gave each of these skinny kids a handgun and said, go fight. Now, there isn't just Metasploit, there, there are lots of tools like this. They, they're continually developed and grown and the community says, oh look, I can add new functionality to it. Which is great, except now you've got this thing that started off life as a little handgun and now it's this massive bazooka and tomorrow it's going to be a tank and pretty soon it's going to become a nuclear warhead. And the question is, has your organisation's security kept up to the same level? To quote Josh, casual attacker power grows at the rate of Metasploit. Which is just a fancy way of saying that the more powerful Metasploit or tools like that become, the more likely it is that um, a kid will just point that gun at your company. So th the question remains, has your organisation kept up its defences at the same rate that which the attack has increased? Or are you still bringing a knife to a gunfight. Stay secure my friends.